fast moving object the size of Manhattan is hurtling towards our solar system and it will make its closest pass to Earth on December 17th. The European Space Agency just captured the most detailed images ever taken of an interstellar visitor. Three Eye Atlas updates and maybe even our best shot yet to clearly see the third interstellar object. And what they found lurking beneath Three Eye Atlas's surface has scientists questioning everything they thought they knew about objects from beyond our solar system. This cosmic wanderer carries secrets from another star system. ESA's Mars orbiters have detected something that's making even the most skeptical astronomers take a second look. The images reveal structural anomalies that don't match anything we've seen from comets born in our own solar system. And the timing of these discoveries couldn't be more critical. 3I Atlas is currently ejecting water vapor at an astounding rate of 88 pounds per second, despite being three times farther from the Sun than Earth, in a region where most comets remain completely dormant. But here's what's really got the scientific community buzzing. The object appears to be shedding material in patterns that suggest complex internal structures, and some researchers are starting to wonder if we're looking at the remnants of something that was once much larger and more organized than a typical comet. If you're fascinated by the mysteries hiding in our cosmic backyard, hit that subscribe button because we're about to dive deep into discoveries that could reshape our understanding of interstellar visitors. Let me take you back to July 1st, 2025, when everything changed. The Atlas Telescope System in Chile spotted something moving against the background stars that immediately caught astronomers' attention. This wasn't just another dot of light. 3i Atlas was traveling on a hyperbolic trajectory, meaning it was moving way too fast for our sun's gravity to capture it. We were looking at only the third confirmed interstellar object ever detected, following the mysterious Oumuamua in 2017, and Comet 2 I Borisov in 2019. While Oumuamua appeared dry and rocky, and Borisov behaved like a typical comet, this new visitor was already showing signs of activity at a distance, where most solar system comets remain frozen solid. Auburn University researchers using NASA's Neil Garrell Swift Observatory made a discovery that sent shockwaves through the astronomical community. 3I Atlas was spewing water vapor at approximately 88 pounds per second, comparable to what one scientist described as a powerful industrial steam vent. Here's where things get really interesting. Most comets don't start releasing significant amounts of water until they get much closer to the sun. 3I Atlas was doing this at 2.9 astronomical units. That's about 270 million miles from the sun, or roughly three times Earth's distance. This kind of activity at such a distance suggests something unusual about the comet's internal structure or composition that allows it to respond to solar heating in ways we haven't seen before. The European Space Agency saw an unprecedented opportunity. As 3I Atlas approached Mars in early October 2025, two of ESA's most sophisticated spacecraft were perfectly positioned to get the closest look at an interstellar object that any human-made instrument had ever achieved. The ExoMars Trace Gas Orbiter and Mars Express, both designed to study the Red Planet, were temporarily redirected to focus their instruments on this cosmic visitor. The ExoMars Trace Gas Orbiter's CASIS camera system, that's the color and stereo surface imaging system, was the first to capture detailed images. What they saw was both familiar and deeply puzzling. The comet displayed a clearly visible coma, the fuzzy cloud of gas and dust that surrounds active comets. But the structure of this coma was unlike anything mission scientists had seen before. Nick Thomas, the principal investigator for the Cassis camera, described the challenge. This was a very challenging observation for the instrument. The comet is around 10,000 to 100,000 times fainter than our usual target. But what they managed to capture was worth the technical difficulties. The images revealed that while the nucleus itself was too small and distant to resolve clearly, the coma showed distinct structural patterns that suggested complex processes happening beneath the surface. Mars Express contributed crucial spectroscopic data using its Omega and SPICOM instruments, while the Trace Gas Orbiter's Nomad Spectrometer analyzed the chemical composition of the material being released. 
What they found was water vapor mixed with carbon dioxide in ratios that don't match typical solar system comets. The carbon dioxide content was particularly high, suggesting that 3i Atlas formed in a much colder environment than the comets we're familiar with. But here's what's really got scientists excited. But what they managed to capture was worth the technical difficulties. The images revealed that while the nucleus itself was too small and distant to resolve clearly, the coma showed distinct structural patterns that suggested complex processes happening beneath the surface. Mars Express contributed crucial spectroscopic data using its Omega and SPICOM instruments, while the Trace Gas Orbiter's Nomad spectrometer analyzed the chemical composition of the material being released. What they found was water vapor mixed with carbon dioxide in ratios that don't match typical solar system comets. The carbon dioxide content was particularly high, suggesting that 3i Atlas formed in a much colder environment than the comets we're familiar with. But here's what's really got scientists excited and a little concerned. The spectroscopic analysis revealed that the water being released appears to be chemically pristine, lacking the heavy isotopic signatures that characterize water in our solar system. This water could have formed billions of years ago in a completely different stellar environment, giving us a direct sample of materials from another star system. The timing of 3i Atlas's journey through our solar system has raised some eyebrows among researchers. The comet's trajectory will take it on a grand tour of our planetary neighborhood. It made its closest approach to Mars at about 18 million miles, and will reach its closest point to the Sun on October 29th at just inside Mars's orbit, before swinging past Venus on November 3rd at roughly 60 million miles. Here's where the story takes an intriguing turn. As 3i Atlas approaches its closest point to the Sun, Earth will be positioned on the opposite side of our star, meaning our most powerful telescopes won't be able to observe the comet during this critical phase. Whether this timing is cosmic coincidence or something more deliberate has sparked debate among astronomers, with some noting that if you wanted to conduct operations while avoiding scrutiny from Earth-based telescopes, this alignment would be absolutely perfect. The ESA images have revealed something else that's got the scientific community talking. The comet appears to be much larger than initially estimated, with some measurements suggesting a nucleus diameter of up to 6.8 miles. That would make it several orders of magnitude more massive than the previous interstellar visitors. As Harvard astronomer Avi Loeb pointed out, we should have detected an order of 100,000 Oumuamua's before discovering an object as big as 3i Atlas. The size discrepancy has led to some fascinating theories about what we're actually looking at. The water production that ESA's instruments detected doesn't appear to be coming from simple surface sublimation, like we see in typical comets. Instead, the data suggests the water is originating from extended sources, most likely large icy grains in the comet's coma, that sublimate as they're heated by sunlight. This mechanism has been observed in only a handful of distant comets and points to complex, layered ice structures that preserve ancient formation clues. The chemical analysis has revealed another mystery. While the comet shows strong water signatures, it also contains unusually high levels of metallic elements that aren't typically found in such concentrations in solar system comets. Some researchers have suggested that 3i Atlas might be the remnant of a much larger object that was disrupted during its journey through interstellar space, possibly by gravitational encounters with other stellar systems or even collisions with interstellar debris. The ESA observations have also provided insights into how 3i Atlas has maintained its structural integrity during what could have been millions of years of travel through the harsh environment of interstellar space. The comet's ability to retain volatile materials like water ice suggests it either formed relatively recently in cosmic terms, or it has some kind of protective mechanism that preserves these materials over vast periods of time. The implications of these discoveries extend far beyond just understanding one unusual comet. 3i Atlas is providing us with direct physical samples from another planetary system, allowing scientists to study materials that formed under completely different conditions than anything in our solar system. Every molecule of water vapor, every grain of dust, carries information about stellar environments that existed billions of years ago. The ESA mission teams are continuing to analyze the data, and what they're finding is challenging our basic assumptions about how planetary systems form and evolve. 
The pristine nature of the water ice suggests that interstellar space might be less hostile to complex molecules than we previously thought, or that objects like 3i Atlas have protective mechanisms we don't yet understand. As 3i Atlas continues its journey out of our solar system, traveling at roughly 81,000 miles per hour, it's carrying with it answers to questions we're only beginning to formulate. The ESA images have given us our best look yet at a messenger from the deep cosmos, and what it's telling us is that the universe is far more complex and interconnected than we ever imagined. The next phase of observations will come from ESA's upcoming JUICE mission, at which will be positioned to observe 3 I Atlas after it emerges from behind the sun in December. These observations could provide the final pieces of the puzzle about what this interstellar visitor really represents, and what its journey through our solar system has revealed about the broader galaxy. The story of 3 I Atlas is far from over. As we continue to develop more sophisticated detection systems and analysis techniques, we're likely to discover that interstellar visitors are more common than we thought, each one carrying unique information about the stellar neighborhoods they have traveled through. What ESA has shown us is that these cosmic messengers are not just curiosities, they're libraries of information about how planets, stars, and entire stellar systems evolve over billions of years. If this deep dive into the mysteries of 3i Atlas has sparked your curiosity about what else might be lurking in the depths of space, Make sure to hit that like button, subscribe for more cosmic discoveries, and drop a comment letting me know what aspect of this interstellar visitor intrigues you most. And if you know someone who's fascinated by the idea that we're receiving messages from other star systems, share this video with them because the universe is full of secrets and we're just getting started on uncovering them.